not too bad a day. Yeah, it warmed up, but uh, you know what? We didn't have that humidity. In fact, we're drying out now. We have clear skies, as you can see on our York Skycam at last report. It was warm. You know, York was up to 80 degrees, but dew points only 61. Yeah, there's dew points have been in the upper 60s to near 70 over the weekend. It was very humid. Uh, but the humidity's down just a bit, at least more tolerable anyway. South southeast winds at around eight miles an hour. We head to Dallastown, taking on Pennsburg to stay title tomorrow. Let's go Dallastown. Partly sunny, warm, thunder shower in western counties, perhaps. They're going to be spotty, though I don't look for much. Hey, out in western Pennsylvania, some heavy stuff. I'll show you that in, in a second. 80 to 72 degrees as we head through the evening. We'll bottom out in the 60s to around 70. Yeah, a little on the mild side, but again, I don't think it's terribly humid. I do think it clouds over though, and there could even be a, a spot or two seeing a shower. Tomorrow, I think starts gray and overcast, maybe a shower in the morning. We break for some sun, and then we get a few thunder showers popping up in the hum afternoon humidity as we get up into the probably low 80s again for tomorrow. A little more cloud cover, low pollen count for tomorrow. It's pretty dormant out there, uh, getting a little dry. I'll check the rainfall stats for the month of June coming up at 6. No uh, problems with the air quality. UV index about a 5 tomorrow. I do anticipate more clouds tomorrow because of more humidity moving in. Look at this pretty good line of storms out over western Pennsylvania. There's actually two lines. You see this first line has been kind of dying out as it moves east. It's moving into this drier air that's on our side of the, of the mountains. Less humidity. Very steamy air on the west side of the mountains. Well, we have two weather systems. High pressure over about Boston. That's bringing in an easterly flow of air. Low pressure over the Great Lakes, bringing up a southerly flow of warm, moist air. From the boundary between the two, that's where the storms are. And I expect most of them to stay off to our north and west as we go through the evening. But a few could sneak in the western counties. We're near 80 degrees in the low 80s now. at southeasterly wind. Hey, you go down to shore this time of year to cool off, right? Well, that's where our air is coming from. And in the 60s overnight tonight, you see how the showers are just spotty overnight and into early tomorrow morning. It's tomorrow afternoon we could pop those thunder showers as we get a little bit of sunshine with the humidity building. And it will build. It's going to be a much stickier day tomorrow. And then we're into the muggy stuff, even pretty oppressive, steamy stuff on Sunday. And it looks like that humidity lasts into Monday. Now, most of the weekend, I don't think it's raining. I think there could be a thunder shower tomorrow. It could be one or two around Saturday and late Sunday, but most of the time it's dry. Monday looks like the best bet of rain over the next several days. Another chance coming in long about Wednesday. Warm temperatures next week, but I don't see anything terribly hot. Let's see how things are on the road.